What is exactly a primary key? Now, if we go back to the e-commerce example that we had, in order for you to store the customer information within a certain table, you had to have one unique identifier for every record, meaning that you had to have one unique identifier for every customer who actually places that particular order. Now, in our case, it's going to be the customer ID. Now, the reason why you want to have a primary key is because it's going to help you a lot in terms of easy retrieval and easy updation of data. For example, imagine you want to extract the customer information for a customer named John. Now, if you didn't have, say, a unique customer ID, and let's say you had two customers by the name John, then you don't really know which information you need to pick. The same applies to updating the data. If you want to update, say, the address of a customer who's named John, but then you don't have the customer ID or the customer ID is not unique, then you don't know which record to actually update.